Stephen DeVita, so winning start to the season. A comment about that performance today? Um, yeah, it was um, a pleasing win. Uh, we started a bit slow. Um, it's the first time a lot of the boys have played together this season. Um, Pre-season was pretty short, um, but happy with the win. Very good, very good. Any standout performances on the pitch there today? Um, yeah, our Italian import, um, Bernardino Parente, um, got us the win in the 89th minute with a wonderful free kick, so I'm um, very happy with, with his performance. And anything to work on during training this week, perhaps? Um, yeah, just a bit of um, bit more structure. It got a bit sloppy at times, fitness was a, a bit low, but um, first game of the season, happy with the win. Fantastic. And as we go for the season ahead, what's your, what's your target for the season as we, uh, as we progress to the next few games? Uh, with the team I've got, I'm pretty confident we'll go undefeated. Dino Parente, winning goal in the 89th minute. Can you talk us through your goal? Yes, well, it was a, uh, an obvious free kick. Uh, and uh, Prado, he had the ball and I, I begged him for it. I thought, I'll, I'll have a go here. It's, a, it's in my range. It's a, it's a possibility. And I was going to aim for far post, and the keeper was over on that side, so I, my only option was to try and get it up over the wall, and, and luckily uh, the gods were good to me, and uh, straight in it went. That's one of the greatest goals you've scored so far in your career? Uh, I would say it was. To win the game like that against the unknown opponents today, that's a, that'll be one of the best I'll, I'll remember. Yeah. Great stuff. Well done, Dino. Congratulations. Is that all right? How's that looking? <coughs> Uh, can you just fix up your posture a bit? That's right. That's fair. Yeah. Yeah. Ian Owen, a winning start to the season. A comment about the performance today? Solid. Very solid indeed. Put into practice what we did during the tough pre-season. And uh, you know, we had a couple of lapses in concentration in the second half. But uh, overall, very happy. A word about uh, Jason Powell with the two goals on his debut. Couldn't have asked him anymore, could we? Huh? Um, two really quick goals first half and uh, put us on the front foot and uh, yeah, gave us a good start. Very good. We've got uh, Beresfield away uh, next week. Some tough opponents, a hard place to go. Um, how are you going to prepare the team for this week? Well, you know, you know what they're like. Physical, and we've just got to match that. And, uh, with the skill and you know, people like Marshy, Webby midfield, I'm sure we'll uh, trample all over them. And uh, it's going to be a long season. This is the first game of the season now. Any targets for the, uh, for the rest of the campaign? No targets. Play each game as it comes, isn't it? Right. Thank you very much, Ian. Yes. Uh, reserves team manager for the Tigers. Uh, three points early on in the season. Any comments? <laughs> yeah, it was good. 3-1 uh, three one, three one win. Uh, two goals by Davidson, Jason, Jason Powell. who had, had a great game, as did uh, uh, Brendan. Um, Hardyman down the, down the left side, and uh, yeah, it's, it's all going to plan so far. You seem to be out the box really quickly. Was that a, a game plan from the off? It was, it was. I mean, um, you know, I took a leaf out of United's book against Bayern Munich, and uh, it's the best way to play against some teams, you know. Right on, on to them from the first five minutes, we got a couple of quick goals, and that settled down the nerves, you know, for the, uh, for the rest of the game. Uh, there seemed to be a very contentious uh, moment in the first half with uh, Josh Webster and the ref. Uh, did you see anything? I didn't. Um, I will, you know, look back and speak to the uh, the FA about it. But uh, it was, um, I don't know, strange. I think he just asked him about a high foot, and he, and he got a yellow, and then he got a, you know, a fair a fair rollicking from the uh, from the official, and I don't know. I didn't think it was quite fair. And, you know, Josh Webster then wasn't his usual self, you know, a combative midfielder, and if he's got a yellow under his belt, it's, it, it hampers, you know, so we're ready to bring Mitchie Allen on, but again, third professional did the job for us and made sure that we got the three points. Here with uh, Mark Mansfield, a uh, disappointing uh, start to the season, Mark. Yeah, very much so, very much so. It's, it's happened to us a couple of times now. Um, some positives perhaps, uh, some of the new guys that have uh, turned out for the team today? Some positives, we look like we can, we can take the ball at moments, but front third just sort of lacked that killer instinct at times, and then of course the, the moments at the back, just not, not quite dealing with things that sh should have been dealt with. Okay. And uh, with Beresfield next week, some things to work mm -hmm. on in training, how, how do you think you can approach that game? Well, I, I said the lads inside a moment ago, it's, uh, a better side, a tougher side, more physical, smaller pitch, so you know, we're up against it, but you know, we've, we've got the quality there to, to get the result, we've just got to 
Just gotta want it, really. Onwards and upwards, Mark. Thanks for the interview. Thanks, mate. Cheers.